Let's go to Robert calling in from Kansas. Go ahead, Robert. Hey, Owen, uh, you're looking good, bro. You've been hitting the gym? Uh, yeah, actually, though, uh, I'm, on a, uh, I'm on a hiatus right now. Oh, yeah? But, we'll yeah, we'll but, keep it up, bro. Looking good. Um, well, thank you. Hey, I take Super Mill Vitality. I, I take the products from InfoWarsStore.com. People can say they don't work. Uh, I'm not going to, uh, you know, bust my shirt off here, but uh, they can suck an egg because they don't know what they're talking about. Oh, it, it's working, bro. Good job. Uh, I wanted to talk about why Flat Earth uh, has such legs and just won't go away. Um, it uh, certainly for me, years ago, I heard that the Earth was flat and thought that uh, the people saying it were stupid and it was ridiculous and I made fun of them, all those things. And then I went out and tried to disprove this nonsense myself. I got a telescope. I used the uh, mathematics that NASA puts out. Um, I'm college educated. I can, I can do these things. And I went out to try and disprove this nonsense. And that was a couple years ago. And well, let me just say that if you go out and look for yourself, Owen, and you, let's say you have an InfoWars Info crew member who's scientifically minded, you guys go out and try to ascertain for yourself what the shape of the earth is, and you will come back at least saying that NASA is lying about something. I mean, well, I've had no qualms. Either. I've had zero qualms uh, talking about the, the fake news and the lies of NASA. I have no problem in putting out my belief that at least the footage we saw from the original moon landing is fake and, and, and other such stuff. But let me be clear here, Robert, because, I, I mean, I'm just perfectly honest with this audience because I, I, I feel like we're all in this together. And I'm just kind of at the helm of the ship. But I, I'll, I'll be honest with you, man. I, I'm getting so fed up. Th this political garbage is getting so low IQ and so pathetic. I, I can't put up with this much longer. I mean, I, I can sit here and debate and, and get in all the news and, until I'm blue in the face, but I'm not going to do that. And there is more legitimacy talking about flat earth than trying to talk about liberal politics and Trump is a racist and all that garbage. That's zero intellect. Bull crap. I'm done with it. And, 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 and here's the other thing, too. We realize, being the tip of the spear at InfoWars, that for us to be straight and for the arrow to hit its target, we have to be aware of our surroundings and we have to be aware of the environment we're in. So for, for me and for InfoWars to be the most effective, we have to come in on here and talk about the topical things talk about the breaking news, talk about the current events, talk about the politics, because that's the environment we're in. And most people haven't been beaten down and berated by this stuff like, like we have for years. But I, I can't do it much longer. If the left wants to continue to play in the mud and not talk about real issues, I'm done. I, I'm not playing in the quicksand to my death. You understand, Robert? So I don't talk about the flat earth and other such stuff and, and the multiverse and that stuff, because that's just not what we do here. And, and, and every once in a while, I'll pepper it in. But look, Here's what I will say to the audience about Flat Earth. You can disprove the current science and math of the round Earth as we're told. That's just a fact. Now, I'm not saying I'm Flat Earth. I'm saying that the reason why Flat Earth is taking off and, like Robert says, has legs is because it's very easy to disprove the current um, shape, if you will, of the Earth. So a lot of people use all of this stuff to disprove what the current mathematics are and the current physics – my argument is that doesn't prove that the Earth is flat. It just says we don't know as much as we think we know about the Earth. I agree with that, Owen. I can't tell you what the shape of the Earth is. I'm just a guy from Kansas, you know. But what I'm but but isn't that, that it though? I mean, isn't that it? It's more interesting for you to go look at flat Earth stuff than to sit here and deal with the same political battles we've been fighting for three freaking years. Well, I fight those battles as well, Owen, in my own way. And, and what we're doing really, brother, is we're wrestling with the devil, okay? And over time, that can be exhausting. And it can, it, you know, this guy, he's been around a long time. He's got a 1,000 IQ. He's got all the angles figured out, and we're trying to fight him, okay? And that, that's, it's exhausting, man. And you're going to get exhausted, and you got to go away, forget about it, and then try to come back. But, yeah, that's, that's what it is, Owen. I mean, we're fighting evil. And if you no, that, 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 that's a good analogy. No, I do like that yeah. analogy. It's it's uh, yeah, it wears on you wrestling the devil. No doubt. No doubt. Yeah, they're but, lying know, to I, us about everything. Owen. They're lying but to I us sit about here, everything. Whether, 
Exactly. And that's why I sit here and I hear out a flat earther and, and I say, look, like they're banning all this flat earth material from YouTube. I'm like, let's house it at InfoWars. Call me a flat earther. I don't care. People call me a racist. I'm the least racist person in the world. I don't give a damn what people call me anymore. I'm going next level. Humans are ready for the next renaissance. We have the information. We can communicate with everybody on every angle from every every, every planet, every, or excuse me, every country on this planet. And yet we're sitting here st st stuck in the mud like, oh, oh, does socialism work? Should we have an open border? Trump's putting kids in cages. Oh, Trump's racist. Oh. Like, dude, get uh, just go away. Go live with the rest of the cockroaches. We're ready to take humanity to the next level. That's the path we're on. And like you said, it's like wrestling with the devil, man. It's like just free our arms, please. Yeah, Owen, uh, you're the man, and just keep it up, bro. Keep putting it out there, and if you get tired, go away, come back, and you, what choice do you have, right? If you know what's going on, if you really truly know what's going on, even a little bit, you have to fight. You have to try and make a future for the people that come after us, because if not, they, they will they'll institute worldwide satanic governments and you will have microchips in your arm, and you will not, if you say if you say Jesus or you say the wrong word, they'll literally, I mean, they'll come get you, man. Well, I mean, that's you, it eventually. They're, they're, that, 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 that's it exactly. Thank you so much for the call, Robert. I, I mean, folks, anybody can look and see where the trend is going. I'm not going to act like I can stop technology. I'm not going to act like I can stop these trends. I, I'm simply going to say, hey, this is where it's going. Are we going to talk about the potential impact? And, and then I have to sit here and get lectured by these limousine liberals about carbon emissions and global warming? Give me a break. They're spraying chemicals in the damn sky. They're putting chemicals in the damn food. I mean, what? It, 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 it's just like, that's what I'm saying. That's such a low IQ thing. I can't deal with it anymore. I, I really, I, I'm, I'm at my wits end with these people. They, I can't grow in their dead end lacking of nutrient soil. I can't grow there.